Hey folks, Scott Kelby here from KelbyOne.com Photography Training, and we've got five tips to help you clean up and speed up your Lightroom workflow. Number one happens over here in the Develop module and these panels. So you've got all these panels that you're working in all the time. Uh, if you right-click right here next to the title, you will see a thing called Customize Develop Panel, and that's what you want to choose. And here's what this allows you to do. It's two different things. Number one, let's say there's a panel you don't ever use. Well, you don't have to see it, just uncheck the checkbox. For example, if you don't use calibration, which few people do, it's way down the list of things people use, you could just uncheck that and now you won't even see the calibration panel. Uh, the other part of this is, let's say that there's a panel that you use a lot. Let's say that you use the effects panel all the time. Well, all you have to do is click on the little three, the little hamburger icon here and drag it up near the top and now it will be the second panel basic and then effects will appear after that if you decide ah, you know what I like it the way it is just go back to default order and if you don't if you wish you were never here at all just click cancel all right so that's number one number two is one to help to keep you from having to scroll so much if you right click in the same spot this time make sure you've turned on solo mode solo mode is one of the greatest things ever for speeding up your work because it only shows the panel you're working in so if you click on split toning it hides the rest to the panels and only shows you the panel that you're working on so you're not constantly scrolling up and down it all kind of appears right here so the days of having to scroll all over the place are over that's number two number three is a pretty good one you know you have these modules up here the library the develop the map the book the slideshow well you do in Lightroom Classic anyway if there's some of these that you don't use let's say you don't use map and come on you don't use map so right click up here and just uncheck map and now you don't even have to see it uncheck the ones you don't use like web nobody uses web turn that off slideshow nobody's using that well, maybe once in a while but only if you have to anyway that's number three number four is a surprisingly easy and good one is simply hide the left panel just hide it Look how much bigger my image got. The left panel is one where like you choose a collection and then you're working in there for 20 minutes, but you leave this open. Unfortunately, it just takes up space. You use this very rarely. You use the rest a whole bunch. So just tuck it out of the way. And by the way, there is a shortcut for that. If you press F7, it shows it and hides it so if you do need to go over here and get a preset or change collections or something just press f7 on your keyboard and you're there the last one is a really simple one but it kind of clears everything out of the way and lets you focus on your photo it's the letter f P press f for full screen gets everything out of the way put your picture front and center or you can press f to return well there you have it folks easy peasy hey we are about two weeks away ah, a little more than a week away actually from the photoshop world conference in las vegas at the mirage come out and join us it's not too late to come go to photoshopworld.com get your tickets now bring a friend have a great time learn a bunch of lightroom stuff we have lightroom classes all day every single day from the greatest lightroom experts gurus and trainers in the industry it's all coming up August 21st through 23rd in Las Vegas. Not too late. Come on out. We'd love to have you. And we'll see you guys next time. Take care, everybody.